We are under the lights this evening as we get you set for another edition of Baseball on the Show. It'll be Diamond Dynasty action this evening between Oregon and California. At the plate, one, two strikes, but it misses one and two. Good night for baseball all in all. Game time temperature, 63 degrees. Now a swing and a miss on the fastball, then the leadoff man is set down here for the first out of the evening. Labor. Fouled off. Letters. They'll try again, one, two. Swing and a miss on the breaking pitch, two away. Radar gun on that slider. Off speed pitch, 91 miles an hour. That's just pure filth. Gonzalez has a read on it, and that's the third out. Here's Cargo, Carlos Gonzalez. He'll lead things off here in the bottom half of the first. Infield in the overshift here. Now the pitch. Now a check swing, but he holds up in time. Ball one. Pulled toward right center field. Randerson is under it, and he hauls it in for the first out of the inning. Coming to the plate now, Buster Posey, as he'll get his first opportunity in this one. Pitch on the way. Lined hard toward right center. Oh, and he misses it. At that point, either it's two and zero. Oh. Clearly working the bottom of the zone, trying to get a ground ball for a double play. Now he goes the other way, and he got a lot of it high and deep to left center field. Soto is back to the track as he takes it for out number two. Now in the box, Gary Sheffield. He takes his first cuts in this one with a man at first and two away. Sheffield from the belt, kicks and deals. Started to go around there, but he holds up ball one. Posey leads off first with a pair of outs in the inning. High fly ball out to straightaway center. Granderson is under it. No trouble with this one, and the inning is over. Next, the power bat of Pete lining in Cody Bellinger as they'll have five, six, and seven here to start the home half of the second. Line drive, and that's a base hit in the center field. Hunter to advance. And look out as that fastball ran in and got him. Ouch, Brand. Stepping into the box, number 15. He stands in for the first time in this one. One ball, no strikes to count. The 1 0. At the ball. Hit hard to the right side. And that's through into right field for a base hit. And they're content to play station to station here. 0 oh 2, here it comes. Hard hit ball to short. Torres brings it in. LeMayhew for one. On to first, and it's a double play, although the run does come into school. In the dirt. To one and two now. Now a swing and a miss as he picks up another one. Make it four strikeouts already, and there's your first out. Back to the top of the order now. And digging into bat next, the ever dangerous Juan Soto. And it's fouled away. He was absolutely all over that fastball. Have to find a way to keep that fair. Started to go around, but it's a called third strike anyway, and that will retire the side. Stepping in and ready. He certainly just missed it. With this guy's big power, he's feeling pretty good at the dish. Driven deep at the wall. It is gone. Not every home run is exactly the same. That ball was absolutely destroyed. The 
catcher, number 28. Buster. Thursday. Foul ball. Bases are empty, one man out. Look out. Don't want to hit him there. It's full three and two. To be honest with you, I'm a little bit more afraid of the guy on deck than the guy that's up right now. If I'm on the mound, I want this guy up right now. He's the guy that's got to beat me. That's his first base hit, making one for two now. Name of the game out on the mound is to disrupt timing of the hitters in the box. He certainly got this guy on the defensive. But this will not get out there deep enough as it's run down by the right fielder in the alley for the second to first safely. 2 0 count. Here it comes. This is hit high in the air out toward left center. Soto is there and he'll make the catch to retire the side. Ready on two balls and two strikes. Here it comes. Half swing here, but it won't matter. It's strike three called anyway, and that's out number one. Ready with the first pitch. Here it comes. Not even close on that swing. No balls and a strike. Boy, this guy's got it going on right now. He's executing everything. He should feel pretty good. He's retired seven in a row. Count now a ball and a strike. A swing and a high drive to right center field. Right fielder looking up. See you later. Over the wall, a home run. You're lucky if you get one pitch a night right down the middle. Cannot be late on that fastball. And he struck him out. And that's eight strikeouts thus far. So, that moves to a ball and two strikes now. And it's fouled away. Two out, nobody on. Oh, and this just jumps off the bat here as this is to deep straightaway right field. And you can pretty much forget about this one. That is a long home run. And it's one and two. Hey, the fish ain't biting there on that 0 2 breaking ball, but you got to be careful because this pitcher. A swing and a drive sent out toward the gap. Judge is going back, but he can't get to this one. It's off the wall. And he is in the second base with a leadoff double. Now that into the box now, number 15. number 15. On a rope to the second baseman. Throw to the bag, and the runner's back in time. So a runner aboard at second here with one away. And the former number one overall pick in American League Rookie of the Year, Carlos Correa, bats next. Unbelievable. A home run. I don't believe what I just saw. I don't believe what I just saw. To the plate now, Nate Pearson. He swings and grounds it to short. And the pitcher's got himself a base hit. At the plate, Carlos Gonzalez. And he turns on one, sending it high and deep to right. Judge is back to the warning track, and he's able to put it away for the second out. On to first. Stepping into the box, Chris Paddock. He'll start into the windup. Here comes the 0-2 pitch. And he punches out another one. Make it nine for the ball game. Ball. Looking for the strikeout. Here's the 0-2 pitch. In the dirt, but swung on and missed. He makes the throw to first. Two down. And that'll bring up Glaber Torres. Just the one away here with the bases empty. And here is Mr. October, Reggie Jackson. Here's a sinker to start him out, but he wouldn't bite. It's ball one. And a strike to even the count. One and one. Oh, break out the tape measure. That one is long gone. At the plate now, now Gary Sheffield takes this the Gary. other way to right. And that's in for a base hit. Make it a one for three games so far. Strike two called, and it's full three and two. 
I think it's a real possibility that they put that run in first in motion. That would help them stay out of that double play that would end the inning, but that's also kind of risky at the same time. Sheffield is on his way home. He will score as they open it up to six to two now. A swing and a drive to center field. That one's got a chance. A ball that's carrying. But he has no chance to make the play. It's off the wall. And the runner will score from second. Here's Carlos Correa now. He swings and sends it in the air to right center field. Heading after it is Judge. He gets there to make the catch, and that ends the inning. Brown. No, says Kenny Jansen. It's ball one. And he struck him out. And there's strikeout number 11. This pitcher's bringing it with some high velo. You better get that front foot down early and get ready or he's going to throw it right by you. Uh, and he's just rolling right now. And even now dozen strikeouts for him in the ball game. <laughs> ready with the first pitch. Here it comes. Well behind you now. Swung on in the dirt. Strike three. The throw to first is in time, and the inning is over. Once again, Carlos Gonzalez is working on a one for three thus far. Good deception on the slider there as he's way out in front. They haven't played perfectly as it's hit on the ground. And there's out number two. Ready for another shot now. Buster Posey. He got on top of one and was a ground out victim last time. Into center field, line drive base hit. So now with two away, the middle of the order gets to bat with opportunities on base. Get underway. Now at the plate, Aaron Judge. He's working on a one for two game so far. It doesn't look very promising so far in this one as we move into the later innings. Down by a bundle, it's time to get some base runners and hopefully a long ball to get them back into this one. Now with the play, DJ is half of the seventh here. Striding in, Gary Sheffield. He's got a hit in three at-bats to this point. A diving try, but it's through into the outfield. And big trouble as this gets to the wall now. And he'll pull into second here with nobody out. Now, from the belt, the pitch. A swing and a ground ball to third. A dive, but he can't get a glove on it. It's through for a base hit. And the runner from second will stay put at third. So they're runners at the corners now with one away. Go back. Into the number box, 15. number 15. As he'll go after the first pitch and bounce it into foul territory. The 0 1 pitch sent out to straightaway center field. Granderson is under it. And he brings it in for the second out of the inning. Now it's cut off. A throw to the plate. And he will score on the sacrifice fly. Digging in, Carlos Correa. And if you remember, I'm sure he does, he hit a round tripper back in the fourth. And he jumps on this one. It's high and deep to center. And that one is gone! Now To the plate now, Eddie Matthews. As he swings and misses at a first pitch fastball, 0-1. As we near the end of this one, I think it's safe to say that the story of the game has undoubtedly been the long ball. Guys, what do you think about what we've witnessed? Well, as a former offensive player, I absolutely love it. Kudos to both lineups for doing absolute damage today. One of the most fun watches of the year. You know, D-Row, what this shows me is this new age way of guys going up there and they're swinging. Jason Isringhausen comes in unexpected. Now back.
In now, Gary Sanchez fouled away. He went down on strikes last time up. Here comes the 0 1. Right over the top with that curveball, and it's 0 and 2. Good thing he didn't make contact with that pitch. Only thing he could do is probably hit that on the ground. It could be a double play ball. And that falls in for a solid base hit, his second of the night. And now this is thrown wildly, just getting it into the infield. The tag comes down, and they're going to get him at third. Aggressive base running there following some shoddy defensive play, but it doesn't work out for him. Now better. So the stepping in. The 0 2 once more. Line hard to center field. And a base hit, so the leadoff man is aboard. Legs churning. He's headed for second. And he's going to get to second now with nobody out. At the plate now, Buster Posey, as he will take strike, but he missed it. Line drive base hit. And they'll get it in quickly. It's first and third now with no ball as the count holds steady at one and two. Popped him up. In comes Judge. He can't get to it. This one's down. And the runner scores from third as they extend their lead. And he is in the second with a double, his third hit of the night. Now back. Cody Bellinger at the plate now. Cody. Oh, break out Bellinger. the tape measure. That one is long gone. So the lineup really helped carry them to victory here in this one. And this man was a big reason why. He's our tops player of the game. Yeah, no question.